Hello, hello and welcome to another tutorial. This time we are going to use Affinity Photo and Affinity Designer. Now, if you don't have Affinity Designer, you can still go ahead and work with me on this tutorial and you're going to see what the limitation is for Affinity Photo. So what I'm trying to do right now is basically simulate this type of pen pressure where we have the thinner line here and a thicker line here all incorporated on a curve. So how I did that is basically I took and I drawn a curve and you can see that right now it's default one this is how you should see the curve as well if you're going to use the stroke here so you can see that I'm using a fill of white stroke it's black and here you can change the point so let's make it thicker and I'll show you how to do it now you have here at the bottom you have pressure so click on this button and a profile will show basically it's a graph where you have this is the left side and this is the right side holding alt or option on a Mac you can change the points individually so you can see if you go down like this it's going to make it thinner you can create another point where you can add something like this and on the right side go to the corner as well so you can see it created you know like a very simple s line with the pen pressure effect if you want to add the same effect to a text like i have here right so let's add the text and we can do i don't know affinity photo and we're going to minimize this one and from the colors we're going to use the opacity to zero and then we're going to the character tab here oops in the decorations you'll see ah first of all if you don't see the character tab could be on the right here or you go to view studio and then you have character here you need to turn this on and this character tab will open and in decorations you go and you choose brush simulation or texture line style let's say and you apply you change the width the cap so basically is how you want the line to finish then you'll see a small window here that says pressure so it's highlighted here so you can click on this one holding alt or option you can move this around and you can see that the lines are starting to thin on one side if we're going to do the same thing of course it's going to disappear but if you move this you'll see that the lines starts to thicken and this cool effect will be created you can create as many nodes as you want something like this for example and unfortunately this is where um, affinity photo ends the options so what i want to do is i want to be able to change the brush type unfortunately you cannot apply another brush except the main um, simple brush that is a and you can change only the thickness I said unfortunately we cannot do that I don't know why they didn't enable this option in in affinity as well but I 
couldn't find any way of changing the brush and I tried but if you have any suggestions or if you know how Affinity Photo does it please leave a comment below I want to be able to add another brush but we will do this in Affinity Designer so let me delete this one you can go here and you have the same character option change the pen pressure as well here I created something like this you can choose how you apply the brush so here we have pens pencil oil let's try to find oil we can choose the width of the brush as well something like this and this looks good now if you want to keep working in affinity photo you just click on this layer control c or command c go here into affinity photo control v or command v and you paste it the interesting thing is that once in here you still can change um, text so let's say put here photo see if we can change the font as well yeah you can change the font and it has the same option so that's cool so now you have another way of working between affinity photo and affinity designer and that's about it i hope you enjoyed this small tutorial hit the like button comment below if you have any suggestions for new videos and subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed until next time my name is alex take care